Hello you lovely people, welcome to this particular video. This video is aimed to IGCC O-Level Accounting, also helpful for A-Levels, LCCI, AAT, University, all the students. Why? Because the top topic is trial balance, a very popular, nice and easy one. Well, what did they say about the trial balance in this particular note? The trial balance is a list of balances of, of every account forming the ledger, distinguishing between those accounts which have a debit balance and those which have a credit balance. Now, uh, debits and credits, we keep writing and at the end, both of the uh, columns should equal if both of these column agrees that means a ledger balances are correct you know the small t accounts and ledger balances we make and at the end we do balance cd cd becomes bd these bds we transfer to the trial balance and if both side agrees that means our trial balance has balanced well before i show you what the trial balance exactly looks like i'd like to go through the accounting cycle how the accounting works um, as an accountant of any company you at first collect documents source of documents of a transaction like a transaction has taken place and you collect invoices sales uh, credit note a debit note and a bank a check counter foil all the source of documents from the source of document we put entry into the day books books of prime entry then we make double entry and from the double entry we make uh, the t accounts ledgers double entry means uh, ledgers from this ledger cdbds we prepare trial balance that's what we're going to talk about not the financial statements well i have a small uh, a definition for the trial balance is a tool and technique to check the arithmetical or numerical accuracy of your ledger balances whether your t accounts ledger balances are correct or not how do you check it you check through a trial balance this is an example of your trial balance look at this name of the company xyz limited trial balance as at 31st uh, january or 31st march the year end debit side and credit side if you remember the debit and credit items, trial balance is the easiest thing in the world for you. How do you remember the debit and credit items? If you remember, PEA, RLS, pearls, doesn't he? Also, DEAD, debt, CLIC. Watch out my other videos regarding pearls and debt click just to identify your debit and credit items. Look at this. Purchases, yes, debit. Sales, credit. Sales return is the opposite of the purchase. It's the reduction in income, debit. Purchase return, opposite of purchase, reduction in expense, credit. Trade receivables, SLCA, debit, current asset. Trade payable, uh, the current liability, credit. Rent, wages, heating and lighting, all these are expense, debit, debit, debit. And uh, office equipment and machinery, these are non-current asset, debit. Cash and bank, debit. This time bank on the debit side means it's a positive money. Could have been on the credit side. Bank overdraft could have been. Loan, liability, credit. Capital is always credit. Drawings is always debit. Look at this. Both sides balanced. 3560, 3560. And that's it. That's all about your trial balance. Hope it helped people. See you in some other videos. Till then, goodbye.